We are on our way back from an epic camping weekend. We did some hiking, we had some beers, and we got some sand between both our toes and our paws. Mm -hmm. We didn't have paws. Our dogs had paws. <laughs> and typically, taking our Airstream travel trailer out for a weekend getaway gives me just a little bit of anxiety because this means that we are going to be cleaning more than typical just with dirt and sand and all that jazz getting in the trailer. But I have to say, after this weekend, I was pleasantly surprised. And that's because Air Gear sent us this awesome RV mat. And now you may be asking, Sam and Lauren, why have you not invested in a quality RV mat in the past? And that's a great question. That is a great question. And the first answer to that is, well, because we're dumb. And the second answer to that is because we have not had any success with RV mats in the past. Well, the previous mats that we've had have collected water, they've absorbed water, which leads to mildew growth. They've attracted dirt, and we've overall been pretty unhappy with, with how they've worked out. Mm -hmm. And then Air Gear, like the heroes that they are, came in and they sent us this Sea Gear sand free mat. And let me tell you that I do think that after this weekend, our perception on our remats has drastically changed. Speaking of sand, we were camping this weekend up at Table Rock State Park mm -hmm. up in upstate South Carolina. It's a beautiful state park if you're ever in the area. They have beaches, they have lakes and great hiking but the downside is the campground has some pretty sandy soil on top of sam and i's four feet there were eight feet and eight paws bringing dirt and sand onto the rv mat and then possibly into the trailer but i did a thorough inspection people and there was hardly any sand or dirt in the trailer this mat is extremely easy to store. Mm -hmm. You just folded it up and we threw it in the outdoor compartment. Yeah, that's definitely one of the perks. And this is an issue that we have had with mats in the past is that they're big, they're bulky, you roll them up, they don't fit anywhere. And this one was incredibly easy to just fold up, throw in the totes and throw outside. Now, our mat is eight by 14, which is a great size for trailers that are about 27 feet to 20, 28, 29 feet in length. But Sea Gear has four different styles in regards to color. And then they also make three different sizes. So ours is the eight by 14 feet. They also make an eight by 11 um, foot mat, which is great for trailers that are between 16 to 23 feet. And then they make an eight by 20 foot mat, which is great for trailers that are a little bit over 27 feet and these are really good for those bigger patio areas and those much bigger rigs but our 14 foot mat actually worked really well for our size it covered the patio area nicely but didn't feel like it was taking up the whole campsite now in addition to this mat being really easy to store it's also very easy to clean you can just rinse it off you can sweep it off uh, and we really put this mat to the test this weekend yeah we definitely had to clean it after we had some brought casualties there was ketchup there was mustard there was everything going on and then Fenton comes through and he's obviously looking up the brats. No one loves brats more than Fenton. More than our dog. So there was dog slobber on the mat on top of that. So all we did was sweep it off, shake it off, and then we rinse it down with the hose, let it dry, put it in the cute tote, and then boom, put it away, which was amazing. And like I said, we really put this mat to the test this weekend, and I can tell you it is very durable. Mm -hmm. On top of the increased traffic in and out of the trailer, we also had two dogs running on the mat while they were playing fetch. And if you have not seen a video of Fenton running while he plays fetch, well, feast your eyes on this and then you tell me how durable this mat is. It's very intense. Mm -hmm. After this weekend, Sam and I can confidently say that our perspective on RV mats may have changed. We may or may not have found the one. I think we found the one. And to air gear and to sea gear, I thank you very much because my type A personality is extremely happy. And thank you for keeping Lauren happy because nothing keeps her happy like a clean trailer. That is true. So, with all that being said, until next time, happy cleaning and happy trails. Happy trails, you guys.